It's a great thing for history. George Washington, Thomas Jefferson, William Howard Taft, and President Barack Obama. One young girl traced them all back to one common ancestor. They're all cousins and all grandsons of John Lackland. It's the first family tree of its kind. Pouring through more than half a million names for months, 12-year-old Bridge Ann D'Avignon discovered that all the U.S. presidents, except Martin Van Buren, are related to the former king of England, John Lackland Plantagenet, signer of the Magna Carta in 1215. Mildred Reed is his first great-grandmother on George Washington. And on Obama, Mildred Reed is the 10th great-grandmother. It started as an assignment to research her own lineage, tracing it back to roots in France. But Bridge Ann wanted to branch out. Well, I think we just all go back somewhere. Or it's just a matter of proving it. She started with George Washington. But unlike other professional genealogists that only looked at the male family lines, Bridge Ann was able to link the presidents together using both male and female ancestry. Before this, historians had only been able to link 22 family trees. She uh, kind of created a triumph of women's studies here. Bridge Ann also figured out she's an 18th cousin of President Obama, something she hopes to be able to share with him in person. I've written a letter to Obama, but I just gotten standard reply. I hope to meet the president and like explain it to him. In Paso Robles, Adam Rakusin, your Central Coast News.